A quick video. I'm here at um, Virginia at my parents' house, and my dad's got a 03 Neon Dodge Neon. Um, just a regular old 2.0. This is a cheap model. I picked up a few years back with about 40,000 miles on it. I think we're at 93,000 now. And it's got a check engine light for uh, PO551, I believe it is, which par uh, power steering pressure switch. <clears throat> I have the pressure switch right here, aftermarket, of course. Um, and I have just changed it. It only takes a couple of minutes. You're going to need a 7 8 socket. I have a long extension on this one. Um, jack your car up is probably the easiest way. This is the sensor. This is the old sensor and I already have it out. Um, it just has one connector with um, two pins in the connector right there, you can see. And basically jacked up the car, went out there. This is the driver's side, went under here. Your orientation, you got your front driver's side tire, power steering rack, and right there, that is the sensor. So you unhook it, um, unplug the connector, like I said, just a little two pin connector, pull it out and then um, take that sensor out. It leaves just a little bit of fluid if you're pretty fast. I, Yep, just a little bit of fluid. Put it back in and top off your fluid. Should be good to go. Make sure you plug your connector back in securely and then you can take your car down and give her a whirl.